Welcome back everyone, Drake Hawkins with again for some more EU4. We are looking at a slightly broken France, needs to break even more. We're in a war that we managed to start against Spain, co-belligerent Austria, so we can hopefully take a good chunk of their territory, considering a lot of it is our core lands. Uh, and they brought in their allied Naples, so we, we got a triple down on this, uh, on this war. Hopefully we'll be able to do a good deal quickly here. Before we get started, if you're enjoying the series, please hit that like button, it helps me out. And if you haven't already joined the clan, hit the subscribe button and stay tuned for more great content. Um, occupied, 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 good. Uh, that crunches out all the... Perf there. Uh, you know what? You cannot get in there. Oh, you can. Okay, good. These... These are... Oh, that's Naples. That's Naples Army. Let's not stand on the hill, on the edge of their territory with, with tiny stacks of dudes. That would be silly. Uh, who's, who's holding them back here? Cuba? New Brandenburg. Poland's declared war on Russia. Oh, okay. Siege finished here. Where's the next one? Where's the next capital? Um... We need that fort view again. I still haven't put that on the list. The next fort is n way down here. Really? Okay. Uh, I'm going to take one of you down south here. Is there one with a leader stack? He has a leader stack. Okay. You come down this way. You're going to go stand in Panama. And we're going to siege the rest of this down with these fellows. Let's just blanket this whole place out. Take them all. And then the 25 stack can come down here. Right here. There we go. Okay, you actually stop moving. Attach. Sail. Ah, uh, no. You know what? That's not a good idea. That's a very bad idea. Since we don't have the naval force control, uh, we don't control the seas there, so let's not let's not fumble around with that. Uh, where are the others? There was another stack, wasn't there? Somewhere? Oh no, that's two of them there. It's two there and one there. Gotcha, okay. And anything going on in this part of the woods? No? No, there's not. Oh, there is Spanish South Africa. We can take care of that. Um, do they have a fortress in Spanish South Africa? Nothing. Okay. So you are going to come down this way then. Good. All right. Bari is sieged. Good. Okay. Naples, are you done yet? Not? Maybe not? No? There, there, there. Oh wait, that wasn't the right button. Let them finish that. You come down this way. I think we can cross, but he can't. So I want these provinces. Mountains, mountains, mountains with an eight fort. Ugh. That's not gonna be, is that gonna be them? Mm, no, because they don't own that, that province. It's occupied by rebels. And they're sieging it down now. So they are the attacker. I wonder if we'll be the attacker or the defender there. I'm very curious about this. It is very interesting. They're going to try to sneak. Yeah, they're going to run around behind. That'll be really annoying, but not really surprising, though. All right, come down this way. And it won't be a, won't be a problem to siege them effectively. Military access to Buryatia. Yes, of course you can. My friend, I don't even know where you are. You're off in south, uh, on the east there somewhere, I think. Um, one more Catholic? Lanca Lank Lanc Lanc Lancastershire? More Catholics to uh, convert? And that's, there's these four, I don't know what's going on with them. I don't know, oh, colonies, right. Zero on Toledo, that's excellent. 
Siege of Tangiers is finished. Also excellent. Uh, I think Fez might be a bad or a, uh, a dangerous spot to take. Oh, we lost some ships here, did we? Hmm. I tell you, this is not a profitable place for ships. The way it's the place that uh, German ships go to uh, captains go to die. That's what that is. Right. Siege up or group up rather. Plus twenty one already on uh, Lisbon, Lisboa, as it were. All right, uh, you can come down this way. And you can come down this way. We'll work our way across the front line there. Yeah, Venezuela is just getting smacked left, right, and center. That's all right. Good distraction. Good work on the distraction skills there, sir. Uh, recall you. Are you really happy with me? You're very happy with me now. That's awesome. Um, what else? Uh, I guess there's nothing else to do there, is there? Colonel Bruno, do you want to just be friendly with me? Can you just join? No? Colonel Bruno, do you have allies? Molly? Hmm. I mean, I don't really need another war going on, so... North Africa, though, would be great. <laughs> if I wasn't busy up here. We'll leave it. We'll leave North Africa. Look at them. They're just going to spew out this nonsense. We can't do anything, so we're going... Portuguese, Colombian, to the military alliance with their enemy, Portuguese, Brazil. That's funny. Oh, yeah. We never did take out, uh... Quito. Quito? There, 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 more sieges successful, conversions successful, uh, start converting whatever is next on the list, I don't really care. There, you keep coming down the line. You as well. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna, uh, yeah, we're gonna stop up and here. That's a good spot. Okay, so that'll siege down the rest of everything there. How are we doing up here? 35 in Toledo, 21 in Lisboa. I, that's that's impressive. They jumped ahead quite aggressively there. Things boosted rather quickly. Minus 49 down in Fez. They got troops running around the circles around behind us. They're just ignoring their fortresses entirely, murking up and sending them in independent batches that aren't large enough to take out fortresses. And they'll go siege down nonsense territory. It's bad AI. Um, I would definitely think that uh, um, Paradox should do... They, they could use with a change. They could, they could use fixing that up. I mean, it's not... Probably wouldn't be too much to ask, right? Let's separate these out as, uh... Yeah, let's separate those out right away. I want the Iberian Peninsula held and controlled fully. Uh, Self-sustaining colony, wonderful. Do we have any colonists? Three available diplomats. 16 mercenaries and two, uh, zero of two colonists. Okay. Our diplomats are not busy, huh? Well... We could talk to these guys. Could we vassal you? Gascony and Tunis are their allies. Could we vassalize you? Yes, you would accept it. Yes, you would accept that. How about you? Yes, you would. How about you? Yes, you would. Okay, you know what? Let's improve relations here all around the board. And that way, maybe we won't even need those fights. Because I think they're all just interlinked alliances basically and it would be easier to take these without having to um, use get the overextension issue how about Luca Luca do you hate me forever and ever all men I think you do I think you do but that's fine you'll be a catalyst to bring Spain or France back into a war soon Toledo the Spanish capital and the war goal wonderfully finished okay Go there There. 
in there. It's 25 stacks as, as our siege, uh, as our uh, carpet sieging. It's kind of nice. Come on, move. Uh, where did we lose those ships? More in Southeast Asia. The China Sea. That was not a loss. 16 Spanish La Plata ships dro dropped. We lost one. Oh, that was, a, that was a rough deal for you guys. Oh, that was in uh, North Africa. I like that. Um, this... Where's the big fleet? He's hanging out here, eh? Yeah, he's, he's blocking up the... The whatever this is. The Gibraltar Strait. The Straits of Gibraltar. ba da ba da ba da ba da ba <laughs> Just fleet battle after fleet battle all over the world. I figured there would be a lot of it. I mean, Spain is a fairly dominant uh, naval force. So, it's not that surprising. Some Spaniards trying to take uh, our holdings there. Minus 42. Okay, you come down here. You come down here. Actually, over here, that would be awesome. Yeah, we're definitely getting some damage to our fleets in various different places. This will crush a good number of them. Nope, most of them just ran away. They all just ran away. We lost two heavies in that? What? How did we lose two heavies in that? Go park in Tangiers, please. Alright, you, um, I guess you're going to start the sieging Granada? Uh, no, you know what, you'll head there. We'll take Sevilla, and you guys can actually shuffle the troops over to uh, Tangiers, and they can head down south. These guys will take Granada. This will take Valencia. Good, good, and good. Uh, do we need, well... 50 is enough to take that fleet. Or that, uh... I'm not sure if you got in enough time to repair it. Well, we go help there, and then we come back. We have 63 lights, 3, uh, 63... Nope, my bad. Apparently not. Crash, bang, boom. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, you can group and attach all over to Tangiers, please. Back up here. You're going to join him. You're now part of that group. You two guys are going to come down here. You stopping along the way. Take that one out. With 0% in Valencia. How are we doing in Austria? Minus 71, plus 21, plus 49. Uh, I forgot I was going to move the troops across and crush these guys, and now we've lost control of the strait there. Hmm. Okay. Let's move your troops over the over the Gibraltar Strait, and then we'll go take care of... Oh. Huh. Finished our first siege in Austrian territory. Soft answer turneth away wrath. The religion of Paris has changed to reform. <laughs> Excellent. Uh, okay, let's hold on a second. You force march your way up here, knock that guy out. That would be lovely. And then I want you to come back down. Where? Then you can come. You can't get to Dalmatia. Then you can come back here, I guess. No. Go up there. Hit there. Go over here. Gotcha. Form conversions successful. Keep them going. Uh, what can we just bump Naples out as is without doing anything more? Uh, we don't have a diplomat, do we? 
No. We gotta pull back our diplomat from Burgundy, I think. We do have to actually physically end all wars at some point. Uh, so that I can... Alright. That province is having some serious hard time getting, uh, getting colonized. <clears throat> Which is understandable. You are going to come down and take. You are going to come down and take. No. Apparently not. Apparently not at all. You're going to come over here then. We're going to grab the transported units. We're going to offload them to here. Good. You are already done. I want you to split and go this way, this way. Uh, one of the colonies I think just finished up there, that's good. 0% in Valencia. We don't have the crossing control there, which we're not getting yet until we end things. Uh, let's actually see if Naples is willing to uh, bump on out of this and give me all their bases. Uh, actually, can I can I vassalize you, Naples? I don't think so. No, 153. I can't. What? Why? We have 99% war score with you, buddy. How do you still have that much will to fight? Well, this would separate uh, separate out the piece. When would this last till? 87. That's only a 10 year peace treaty. No, their treaties with who? Nobody, because I like their treaties. Their treaties are great. Now, you know what? That's fine. Let's just do that. Let's just take a couple provinces, end things with them right away. Siege of Fez is over. You guys aren't going to be able to do diddly squat, because there's too many of you and not enough forts to get through. Hmm. Luca. <laughs> we may want to get to war with you. Oh, we can't. We're still in the truce situation until 89. Oh, 12 years, really? Do we just break truces, or what? Like, breaking that truce is going to be massive bad. If we're going to break a truce, it'll be with France, though. Where's the actual me icon, please? Can I see the... There we go. 92. 1792. Ah. Columbus will be gone for almost 300 years by this point. 1792. That is a long time to wait. A very long time to wait. Hmm. I mean, I don't know what to do with... Oh, there we go. Did you get him? You got 3k. Hopefully you'll get the army now that he's there. I guess you guys can just go up to... Uh, pardon me. Go up to... the cross yet? No. Let's split you in half. Send the general one up to here. And he can start helping with the siege territory up there, the blanket sieging down there. Once that's cleared up, you're coming across the coast. We have Spanish revolutionaries trying to take back the forts we just rightfully took. That's kind of awkward. Hmm. Spain is at medium for this war right now. Austria is the only one still wanting this war to continue. There we go, and Austria just lost another fortress. You're gonna come straight down here. What's your uh, siege? You got a three siege. You have no siege. Hmm. Okay. That's not alright. Uh, what's your siege, Commander in Chief? Four. That's fantastic. How about we let you do that then? Germany occupies Ciota. Fez is taken. Sit over this way. He's got another mountain fortress here in the hills. 
We still haven't crossed the water. We've got an unloaded here. Gee, there we go. It's gonna say Jeep. Come on, get on. Get on with it. Uh, let's head off to the east and take care of the ships here. Hmm. How to do this? Like, Gascony and Tunis, Burgundy, you have no allies. All of you guys can be vassalized. I, I should have checked to see if I did this right, but I don't know 100% sure if I uh, chose the right amount, the right thing here. If, if I could entirely gobble them up next time, I don't know. But their truce is actually going to end before... That's 87, and this one is 92. Yeah. Yeah. That's going to be some long truce timers. Don't like them long truce timers. When I'm trying to smash bang and crash through the entire world in a hurry because I took too long getting there. That's all right. We will, we will press the limit here if we have to. If that means doing some... Uh, some breaking of some truces, then that's what that means. Gain 100 population again there. Good, that's that's going in the right direction now. Down this way. Well, we're running out of we've run out of time for today's episode actually. So let's uh, let's uh, end things off here. We are pushing the Spanish pretty much as hard as we can. I want this siege before they get that one, but I don't know if that's going to happen. If they unsiege un those two to rebels, then it's going to be. Trouble, trouble, trouble. Nothing but trouble. Uh, take a couple more cores there. We're just constantly coring stuff, but at least it's not in the way high hundreds and stuff and causing other problems. Um, I really want Luca, and I really don't want to wait for forever for Luca. They're allied with Tugort. Luca would join in if I declared war on them? Oh. Well, that would be fantastic. I don't know if that's enough. Well, I could co belligerent them. And their ally is who? France and Tugurt. I don't think they'll be able to bring France in. I don't think France will accept it, but this might be our way in. We'll look at that, though, next episode. Let's finish crushing. Uh, um. Crushing Spain here and Austria and get as much from each of those as we can and then see what uh, conspires. Because we could, instead of friending these guys in, we could aggro them. And if that sparks a war with Luca, that's great. Especially if we co-belligerent Luca for max uh, control, um, max war score at the end. Basically, we can take the most. And then if they could bring France in, that would be absolutely delightful. But we'll see if we can worm th our ways through some of that successfully before the end here. Thank you all for joining me once again, and uh, we will see you in game.